Hey, this is Brett with Summit Auto in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. I'm super excited to be showing you this brand new 2020 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Willys Sport Edition with the all new 3 liter V6 Eco Diesel motor. It's going to pump out 260 horsepower, 442 foot pounds of torque, and it's going to get you 29 miles per gallon on the highway. 22 city for an average of 25 miles per gallon in a full-size Jeep Wrangler Unlimited. On top of that, it's in the most popular color for the Jeep Wranglers, Sting Gray Clear Coat. Paint coat is PDN, if you were wondering. And uh, we shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second, so if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device, turn them on right now because it is definitely your best way to check out the looks and styling and the color of the vehicle as well as all the options. I'm going to get right under the hood here and show you the engine. If you want to check out all the photos on this Jeep in the upper right hand part of your screen, there's a link right to our website. Click that and check us out there. So we got the 3 liter Eco Diesel. It's really not that much louder. I'm going to get close with the microphone here so you can hear it run. And honestly, when you're driving this thing, you really don't hear um, you really don't hear how much louder it is than the uh, gas motor but just wanted to get under there and show you that right at the beginning here um, it's got brand new tires for this year Firestone Destination MT2s these are LT255 75R17s they definitely have a mud terrain tread pattern to them uh, this one's going to come with the plastic fenders you get the Willys logo on the side here those are just stickers so if you wanted to take those off you definitely could but uh, the Willys package is also going to get you the gloss black grille and the gloss black fog light bezel trim. It does have the fog lights, of course, and you get the little Jeep logo in the headlights. You get the halogen lights on the fenders. You also get the little sandals on the front there. You get the rock rails with the Willys package. You also get the T50 indicators on the doors to let you know which Torx wrench to take those doors off. And we're going to take a look at the original window sticker, sticker here. Feel free to pause this at any time um, if you want to check out all the options. I'm not going to go through everything. I'm just going to go through the um, optional equipment, which is the Willys package, which is a $1,700 option. You get the all-weather floor mats, anti-spin, the heavy-duty disc brakes, um, the deep window tint, and then the um, gloss black stuff that I was showing you. The trailer tow and heavy duty electrical group is $795. Gives you the receiver hitch, four pin, seven pin wiring, the auxiliary upfitter switches, the 240 amp alternator, and the 700 amp maintenance free battery. Um, so the Eco Diesel and the eight speed transmission come as a pair. Um, total is a $6,000 upgrade over if you were to get the manual with the V6 uh, gas. The 1295 is for the three-piece hardtop, and then it does have an engine block heater. Total MSRP is 43175 and if you want to check out the uh, price, the summit price in the upper right-hand part of your screen, there's a link to that. Um, one thing to note here is that you get a five-year, 100,000-mile powertrain warranty with the, the, the diesel motor, which is uh, 40,000 more miles than the gas motor. So just something to think about if you're considering the Eco Diesel, you do get that extended powertrain coverage on there. 29 miles per gallon on highway, 22 city for the average of 25, and it's not really rated much on the um, government five-star safety ratings. Um, it does have a three-star rollover. It does have those topographical all-weather floor mats, uh, which are pretty cool if you like geography. Once again, those rock rails on the back, you get those four-wheel disc brakes on the vehicle. You get the plastic bumpers and the fenders. There's a better look at that rim. They call them the Moab black rims. The HD backup camera. The Eco Diesel logo is a gray and black and neon green looking logo. Pretty cool. There's that receiver hitch. You got your four pin and your seven pin wiring. Lots of room back here. That door opens up a lot lighter than the uh, old ones, a lot easier. There's your case for the front hard top pieces. Back hard top piece comes off very similar to the old ones. You got four bolts on each side, two quick disconnects. You got a spot for those disconnects to sit when your top is off. 
Uh, these bars are all painted back here uh, to match the vehicle, which is pretty cool. You do get storage underneath here, and you get door hinge holders, roof bolt holders, and windshield bolt holders, and then your uh, jack tools are underneath there. So that glass closes just like the old ones, and the doors close just like the old ones. You do get that JL badge, which gives you your wheelbase and overall length, as well as water fording capabilities. Those doors shut nice and smoothly. You get the metal fuel door, which is pretty nice. And it does have DEF, um, so that's where you add your DEF as well. So something to note, these do require DEF. Really a good looking color. I know it's been uh, one of the most popular colors of the videos that I do. Inside, it's pretty base in here. You get the black cloth interior. It's just the standard seats in here. Driver's seat, height adjuster, all weather floor mats, manual locks, manual windows. You do get the digital speedometer in here. And um, it does have a compass display and you can have mileage display. Um, outside temperature display as well. Whatever you want on those corners, you can pretty much choose it. You get the Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, cruise controls on the right. It does have audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. Comes with the five inch touchscreen Uconnect radio, Bluetooth capabilities, AM, FM. And the big thing is the HD backup camera that shows up here. You can see just how nice and crystal clear that is. Those are dynamic grid lines, meaning that they're going to turn as you turn that steering wheel. And that center line is lined right up with your receiver hitch. So um, when you're hooking up to a boat or a camper, pretty easy to do. Down here, your climate controls. You do have your start stop capabilities, your stability control, and then your downhill assist control. You can turn that start stop off by just pushing it, but you gotta push it off every time you start the vehicle. Down here you got the AUGS USB and USB-C jacks. Those are your upfitter switches that come with that trailer tow group. You got the 4x4 shifter on the floor, the 8-speed automatic transmission. You do get the key fob, which is a proximity key for inside the vehicle, so you can use the push button start. Um, however, there's no keyless entry on it, but it does have the flip out key on there. You get that painted dash finish there. The hard top pieces in the front come off very similar to the old JKs. You got two quick disconnects there, one over there, two more up front, and then your latches on the front there. And those pop right off. All the lights in here are LEDs now, which are pretty nice, a lot brighter than the old ones. And that's, like I said, there's not a ton of options on the, uh, on the Willys Sport packages, but we'll take a quick look at the back seats as well. Lots of room in the back seats, a lot more anyways than the old JKs. Uh, you got the latch child safety systems. You do get speakers up there. And these seats, not only, so the headrests now go down like so when you have the seat up which is pretty nice. And those seats go down almost completely flat. And you'll notice that there's even still some room in between there. All the old Wranglers, they'd always get caught on this pocket there on the headrest. And it was kind of tough to, to get them down sometimes. That topographical all weather floor mat goes all the way across on the back here. And you do get the child safety locks on the back doors. And that pretty much does it. Like I said, not a ton of options on this Wrangler. I'm going to do one more walk around here and I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully you got a good look at the Wrangler, got a good idea for the um, Sting Gray clear coat color, learned a little bit about the Eco Diesel motor, a little bit about the styling on the Willys and what that package all gives you. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to our website, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left. A link to more Wrangler videos like this one on your right. If you haven't been to our website on the bottom, a link to this vehicle on our website. 
click those, check us out. We would look forward to helping you with this Jeep.